hello friends in this video we are going to install the uh, drupal modules using the composer in last video we have checked how to install the drupal modules using the uh, manual process so in manual we have to uh, download the zip folder from the drupal.org and uh, uh, put that folder in a country folder and uh, that is the manual process using the composer uh, it will automatically download that module and all its dependencies required for that module so for that uh, you will require the composer module to be installed in your uh, system so i have already installed the composer now i'm going to download the paragraph model for this uh, video i will show you how to download that model so my website name is dev php and uh, in the root folder i'm going to click here um, git bash here you can check if uh, uh, the composer is a uh, <coughs> installed or not in your machine so i have uh, entered the command composer so it will show that composer 2.1.8 is already installed uh, now uh, I want to download the paragraph model for that I will go on the drupal.org download paragraph so this is the paragraph model so in my process we download this way but uh, using the composer we just require the model name and the command to run in a com um, command to run with the composer like uh, for to download the model write the composer require drupal slash paragraph this is the name i have copied paragraph name copied from this uh, drupal.org website and uh, click on and, and en enter the so i will check that uh, in my config folder there right now there is only admin toolbar module which i have uh, installed so now the paragraph model is installed uh, for paragraph model the entity reference revision model is also the required that's why uh, composer automatically download this dependency for the paragraph model <coughs> now go to the website on the extend and now install our downloading is completed So now select here uh, paragraph so here the entity reference revision model is required for that so first we will install that uh, entity reference and after that uh, we will install the paragraph model so the entity uh, reference model is enabled now now enable the paragraph model these all require models are there now and the paragraph model is also uh, installed uh, now you can see see in our structure the paragraph model is is installed and uh, we can create the paragraph from that page so guys uh, that's it from this video thank you for watching the video and please don't forget to subscribe and like if there is any suggestion you can uh, or queries you can mention in a comment thank you